TV Universe new episodes. I'll be reviewing them. Cue the intro in 3, 2, 1. What's going on? It's me, Junior here, and welcome to another video. And today, we are reviewing a whole week of Steam Universe episodes, starting with Sworn to the Sword. And if you, before we start the video off, allow me to say 22 subscribers so far, let's go to 30. Make sure you slap that like button, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And we'll keep on doing these videos more as you guys like them. So, Today we are talking about Sworn to the Sword, one out of the whole week of Steven Universe episodes that I'll be reviewing, so, yeah, that's gonna be awesome, and, just slap that like button, keep on going, I'll keep doing these week, these daily reviews for the whole week, to, because I'm taking out of my busy schedule to entertain you guys, because I love you guys, and so, basically, this Steven Universe starts off with a new intro, fresh intro, that they made, and it's awesome, and it's gonna be awesome. Go check out the episode if you if you missed it. If you're a Steven Universe fan, go out, watch it. It's the intro is pretty cool. So I like the intro. So it starts off with Steven and Connie doing a jam session, which that was a good episode. That was a good start to it. I really loved it. And so when Steven tried to eat a biscuit with jam on it, seagulls start to come on. Connie scares them off away, which is pretty cool, I guess. But still, Connie want, maybe wanted to be a sword fighter so he can protect Steven and stuff. Because she, this is, this is Earth and she loves it too. So, basically, she, Steven gets this idea to go to Pearl and tr try and train her to be a sword fighter. Which, I was, I dropped. <laughs> and so... She said she reluct. I guess she, at first she reluctantly accepts, and then when she was trying to te teach Connie, it was a song pops out and it's really, it was really nice in my opinion, but it was really good. So Connie starts to take things seriously and it's really good. She's trying to make things right for herself, trying to protect Stephen and herself. But Pearl gets too intense in the sword fighting training, and she tries to say that she doesn't. She um. She tries to um. I cannot say this right. My apologies on that. But she she says that she cares about Stephen and nobody and nothing but her and not herself. So it's really messing up, really messing me up on that part. And Pearl says every time she was on her side, she keeps on dying and coming back because gems can regenerate from all matter of wounds. But it takes time, but she keeps coming back to help protect Rose and stuff. And then Connie starts to realize what she's doing and stuff. And realizing that she needs Steven to protect her and himself. So they team up. Team defeat all the Hollow Pearls. And Battle Pearl. But they're easily defeated. Because they're not trained enough. And Pearl, said, and Trump Pearl breaks down. Because she said. She said. I wanted to protect you Rose. And technically Steven. And her mother is themselves. But I'll, I'll touch on that in a later video. But still. They they stop because Pearl said that's enough training for today and she talks about it and she realizes that she needs people to protect her and herself. And so they they said they are good knights and stuff. So they talk about um what to do next and it ends off with a, with a sword. The camera moving to a sword and the episode ends. Which now for my re my review, this episode was pretty great. I'm not gonna lie, there was a few intense scenes here and there, but all in all, I really enjoyed it, and it was really fantastic. The scene between Pearl and Stephen and Connie were pretty 
saddening in my opinion, but it was good. It was nice, and I and my my um rating, I give it a solid eight. So that's my review on Steven Universe episode. So it's sworn to the sword, first day out of the whole week of reviews that I'm doing for all Steven Universe episodes, and my review on the whole series in general, mine was way overdue. This series is really fantastic. I'm just so excited for what's coming next, and it's just good. And it was this series is really living up to the potential of other shows like Adventure Time and Regular Show and all those other shows that come that come before that. But still, this series is great. I loved it. I'm glad to keep on watching, and I love to see what comes next. So that's my review on Sworn to the Sword and my review on the whole series in general. If you like this video, make sure you comment, share, subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and subscribe to my channel for more content like this. I will be posting up a Minecraft series time in, in time, but still, let's keep this Steven Universe train rolling. Slap that like button, and and I'll be reviewing the next one tomorrow. So thank you all for watching. I'm Baka King, and I will see you all later. Goodbye!